cowboy. Well, I'm packing up my game and I'ma head out west Where real women come equipped with scripts and fake press A bottle of scotch and watch lots of crotch Buy a yacht with a flag saying chill in the most Then rock that bitch up and down the coast Guys, don't you just love it when, uh, 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 long story short I've already done this video only to find out that something went wrong with the camera And I wasn't on the camera so the surprise for me is uh is is going to be less surprising than it was yesterday when I did this video from my friend Mr. Holster if you are not subscribed to Mr. Holster Right down at the very top of the description box is a link to his channel. Would you please be so kind as to go over there? And then make sure you hit the little bell so you get notified of all of his videos. Check out what he has. He has a very entertaining channel. He is a very nice guy. And I'm honored to call him a friend. And Sunday, I finally had the opportunity to shake his hand and meet both Mr. Holster and Mrs. Holster. Had a awesome day, and uh, uh, guys that already follow the uh, Brew channel already know because he was my guest on the Brew channel, and he gave me some items uh, for the for you guys um, that don't follow the Brew channel. Uh, he gave me uh, the shirt. A double shot glass. I think that he said this was his grandmother's. Um, cousin Jimmy. Yes, you'll have to go over the channel and find out who Cousin Jimmy is. Cousin Jimmy uh, gave me some uh, ant anti uh, monkey butt. That'll really come in handy. And uh, the uh, Ebomi gerbil retrieval kit. Uh, if you have no idea what that is, you can skip the Ebomi part, but just you know, Google it. it comes with a little uh, lasso and some uh, some rope. Yeah. And uh, last and and probably uh, my favorite item that Mr. Holster gave me was a signed picture from Jack. Yep, there he is having a little knob. So that's what. Uh, oh, and uh, and a bottle of. Uh, uh, Chavez uh, Regal, 12-year-old uh, Scotch whiskey, and uh, Crazy Scotsman, you'll see that it's spelt correctly. Now, you may say, oh, that's cool, a 12-year-old uh, bottle of Scotch. What's so special about that? Well, here's the thing. It was 12 years old in 1970. So... Yeah, so it's uh, much older than 12 years old now. And there was a total of three bottles uh, from this scotch. This was from his, uh, his father's uh, collection. And uh, he gave me a uh, Ruger pin. And, <coughs> excuse me. Uh, kind of set up just like a uh, pocket watch, but this is actually uh, for uh, uh, cutting cigars. Uh, this particular one works very nicely on the petites. And then he said this all came from the same vintage as the Scotch. Uh, some uh, Cutty Shark, uh, white labeled. These are all scotches. Uh, Ambassador, never heard of it. And uh, some uh, gold Schlager. I know this was really popular back in the 80s, and I uh, never tried it, but it actually has gold leaf in it. <laughs> then, uh, 
He gave me some uh, 38 Special Brass, the infamous uh, gun lock, and trust me, if I had $10 for every one of these I've thrown out, I would be uh, talking to you from my private yacht in the Caribbean. And then he uh, gave me a, a chrome silicone uh, spring, AR buffer spring, and I've heard a lot of good things about these, uh, Mr. Holster, so I, uh, I look forward to using it. And then... Uh, one box of uh, 556 five, and seven boxes of uh, 223 ammunition. Uh, pretty much uh, round out the uh, uh, stuff that, uh, that he'd left uh, sitting on my dining room table. And then next to all that was an unopened box. It was unopened yesterday when the camera decided not to play along. And uh, what is in that box? Well... A replica of the 1851 Colt. Uh, to be to be totally honest, uh, I had just got done watching the video that he did on this, which is the only reason that I uh, understood uh, the other items in the box. Is and I have to honestly say. What this, what this pistol or revolver represents is even cooler than if this was a fully functional uh, revolver. This particular one is a Hollywood prop gun. And uh, what, <coughs> excuse me, what, what they did is uh, they offset... <coughs> wow, they offset the uh, bore in the cylinder so that you cannot chamber a live round into it. But you can chamber these blanks. And the history on this revolver is that it might even be it might even be the gun that Robert Yerk is holding in his hand right there but this was supposedly in the movie The Lazarus Man with Robert Yerk and uh, you'll just have to trust me Mr. Holster I was very shocked and surprised uh, and honored that you uh, would would give something like this to me uh, yesterday when I opened the box but uh, so cool I uh, I plan on having it uh, on display uh, uh, right here with uh, Jack's uh, Jack's picture and uh, I definitely <coughs> I definitely will keep uh, that uh, with it. <coughs> uh, maybe it's a little dry down here. Hold on. You guys, um, anybody that's, uh, thank you, thank you. Anybody that is unfamiliar with Mr. Holster. Um, Mr. Holster is, uh, has been, uh, battling the, uh, big C, and, uh, he set up a Patreon account on his, uh, on his channel, and he, uh, really doesn't mention it much because of the kind of guy that he is, but I'm gonna mention it. Uh, I am, I am a member, and, uh... He simply wanted to use any of the extra money to be able to keep being able to do videos uh, go with with everything that's going on uh, in his life health wise so I'm gonna mention it um if I can I think I can put a link down there you should go check it out he doesn't ask he doesn't ask for much 
but uh, every little bit definitely helps. Uh, so, Mr. Holster and Mrs. Holster, I very much appreciated uh, getting the opportunity to, uh, after uh, after uh, years of knowing knowing you, uh, being able to finally shake your hand and get the opportunity to hang out for the afternoon and participate in the, the little train wreck that I call the uh, Brew Review Channel. What I really look forward to is that evil bitch known as uh, time will not creep up on us uh, too quickly uh, because me and Christine would love the opportunity to come out and shoot at the hard target range. Little something compliments of uh, uh, our friend uh, Gil, the owner of Hard Targets. So, Mr. Holster, Mrs. Holster, uh, really appreciate the time that we had together and look forward to uh, uh, many more. Sixty-year-old shot of scotch. Mm. It's extremely smooth. It's extremely smooth. If you're wondering, so guys, check out Mr. Uh, Holster's uh, channel. Uh, make sure that you uh, ring the bell so you get notified of his new stuff. Please check out his uh, Patreon account and uh, give him a hand if you're able to. And Mr. Holster and Mrs. Holster, thank you so much for all the goodies. Jack, thank you. Thank you for the, uh, the autographed, autographed picture. Like I said, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put the Colt, I'm gonna put the Colt right there with it. Okay, guys. Cheers.